remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? According to reports, the Trump administration proposed a rollback of Michelle Obama's school lunch guidelines on her birthday, January 17th. In 2010, Michelle Obama pushed forward with the Healthy Hunger Free Kids Act, but now the Department of Agriculture is saying the Obama policy is leading to high food waste and high cost. Department of Agriculture Secretary Sonny Perdue said schools and school districts continue to tell us that there is still too much food to waste and that some common sense flexibility is needed to provide students nutritious and appetizing meals. We listened and now we're getting to work. That is a damn lie and y'all know it. The Trump administration don't give a damn about students. They don't give a damn about students' health. They are concerned about money. Bottom line, money. And I personally don't believe that there's a lot of food waste. Because if a person is hungry, they are going to eat. And if healthy alternatives is all they have, that's what they're going to eat. You can't tell me no different. I've been one of those people that was hungry and did not have options. So I ate what was available. So when they start talking about food waste, ain't no food being wasted, man. That's game. What they're trying to do with Michelle Obama is a continuation of the disrespect they shown toward any type of policies that Barack got pushed through. They are trying to just destroy the program just because it has Obama's name on it. All they're going to do is go in there and retool the program and rename it and put Trump name on it. That's all this is about. And how petty is it for him to do this on her birthday. This is not a coincidence. They do stuff like this all the time. Just like even in criminal courts. In criminal court, they may set your trial date or they, they may set your sentencing date. They'll set a convicted uh, uh, felon's sentencing date on the same date that they ha may have committed the crime. They may set it on the same date that if they murder somebody, they may set it on the same date that that person was murdered. These people know what they're doing. It's, it's, it means something. These dates mean something. In almost all cases, these dates are not random. They pick these dates out specifically to add some type of punctuation, you know, on the sentence or, or, on, or on their on the case in this in this situation on this on this policy they don't like the policy because it says obama it has michelle obama's name on it it's her signature program and they don't like it because they're a bunch of old raggedy fat men all of them are out of shape. They don't give a damn about health. They're out of shape. They don't care nothing about health. Look at Trump. A professional glut eating junkie. Just a just junk food eating human garbage disposal. He sit on the toilet and eat. That's like a ritual for him. He don't even sit at the table like normal people. He eats so much, he gluts so much. He just eats so much unhealthy stuff, he just sit on the toilet and eat. He eat his dinner on the toilet. I'm serious. Well, at least that's what I believe. 
Because I can't see him eating at a table. He wouldn't make it. He just, he just glut. Just like in real life, just like when in business, he's a, he gluts, just trying to take everything for himself. So same thing with food. He can't get enough of food. He's got to have some, he got to have some pizza. He got to have some hamburgers, double meat cheese, of course. He got to have some snicker bars hanging around. He got to have some KFC chicken, some Popeye's chicken and churches. Hearts on top of that. He got to have hot sauce, ketchup, mayonnaise, and mustard, and barbecue sauce, and salad dressing. He put all that on chicken. The dude is disgusting. He don't know the first thing about eating healthy, and the Trump administration don't know nothing about eating healthy. They don't care anything about eating healthy. This is all being done out of spite. Trump is a very spiteful person. Remember on Tupac's birthday when Trump issued that statement against Tupac's godmother, his fugitive godmother, Asada Shakur, talking about capturing her and she's a, a wanted fugitive, all by design. America is the most obese nation in the world. It's something like 38% of all adults are obese, including Donald Trump, your president. Obese. He cares nothing about the obesity problem in our schools. Because if, even if he did, guess what? His kids ain't got to go to public school and eat that stuff. He cares nothing about that. If you put party over country, you're not a patriot. You're a traitor. I want y'all to think about something. Just in case you was trying to give Trump the benefit of doubt. This is the same guy who fed world-class athletes McDonald's at the White House. Let this sink in. No more talk. What the ladies talking about? Yeah.